evening everyone, I hope you've had a great week. Welcome back to the shooting channel. I hope you got a chance to have a look at the D Sport. What did you think to that? Divisive. There'll be lots of opportunity to see loads of different people's guns as we get out and about heading towards the competition season, the game season. And if you haven't already, please do like and subscribe to this channel. I'm here every Tuesday with your latest shooting news. First up, you should have all seen the excellent and greatly positive headlines surrounding the grass season. This industry is really starting to turn the tide on public perception. It's fantastic news, literally, and it helps us get the conservation side of shooting straight with the general public. We are the lifeblood of many a rural economy, the guardians of the countryside, winter watchmen and honest sportsmen. It's great to see Bass pushing this forward into the public eye. Thank you. Meanwhile, the DWCT are working with six countries and 14 different partners in order to restore farm and wildlife by up to 30%. Focusing on partridges, the book discusses the role of farmer, hunter, winter cover and predation pressures. A partridge has declined over 90% since the 1970s. Now, for those of you who haven't seen, our friends at the National Gamekeeper Organisation have released a film about moorland keepers and carbon. Do take a look at this and we'll be hearing more from them in the coming weeks. It's always good to be so well informed on such seemingly mystifying matters. As I've said before, if we could all introduce just one more person into the shooting fraternity, wouldn't that be an idea for the sector? We have plenty of material to help inform and educate people, this show being just one of them. So please do like and share and I can keep you up to date with all the latest shooting news. Speaking of which, I've got the latest CPSA results for you in the description. Well, the link anyway. Congratulations to Luke Elliott, the high gun, 97, on what was by all accounts a very hot day. And finally, some news from the GTA. Well, not exactly. Many of you will know former Gun Trade Association chairman Chris Price. Did you know he's released a new book about his service on a lifeboat? Again, I'll put the link in the description for you. I'm Alex Sayer. You're now up to date with the latest shooting channel news.